Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Greekazon product review. Today's review is a very interesting product. Um, before I talk about it, let me introduce my partner and co-host, Foti Stamos. What's up, Foti? Yasu Ari. How are you? I'm actually good when we're doing these reviews because I get to try a lot of cool, fun, and tasty stuff. I know we do we do a lot of uh, video podcasting and and whatnot, but these are do wine, but <laughs> but uh, these are fun because we get to try all these cool Greek products. Uh, tell us a little bit about what we're trying today. Um, so we are very fortunate to work with a uh, great company out in Athens that's uh, been our gateway to these uh, new products coming out of Greece. And there's a company called Jukeros, which uh, you'll find on our app, uh, which is producing these interesting spreads and jams mm. and chutneys. Um, and the one that we're going to try today is called Magic Mastic. Oh, that's awesome. So Magic Mastic is a, um, a spread that's made with mastica. You know, for us, mastica is a very uh, important part of our food culture. Um, and we'd love to elaborate more on that as we do different segments. But this particular spread is made with uh, nectarine, uh, agave, and mastica, and some great other ingredients that go along with it. But what's more important is we want to try this with you and taste it together so you can get a little more of a, a personal perspective on what we're having. Uh, let me point out a couple of things. It's preservative free, which I love very much. No added sugars. Yes. And what other what other well, some of the things? aspects that we want to make point out is that all of our products that we feature are all natural. Mm -hmm. These happen to be vegan, non-GMO. Uh, they come from biodynamic. I'm sorry. They come from organic sources. Uh, there's no preservatives, no artificial flavoring. There's none of that funny business that goes in a lot of uh, jarred products in the market today. I mean, look at the ingredients. You won't be able to... This is a very small list of ingredients, but let me just say real quick. You want to you know, read off real quickly the ingredients? Yeah, it's nectarines, agave nectar, citrus fruit pectin, lemon juice, and Heos mastic oil. Like, That's it. how amazing is that? So the less you see an ingredient list the better it is oh you. god yes less is more always especially here in the states so why don't we crack the jar open all right nice little packaging right i like it yeah uh let's see here we go i give it a little oh you think you're better than me my dad taught me that oh it pops oh in. oh smell mm -hmm. that immediately Mastica like punches me in the nose. Oh wow, I love it. <clears throat> but wow, this is this is where we need uh smell a vision or, or or smell internet or something because this is amazing the smell. I can smell the ripeness of the of the nectar. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, I could sniff this all day. Uh that might become addicting. Then you'll have a problem. <laughs> I'm gonna so check into rehab for for uh, <laughs> magic mastic addiction. What's your vice? I can't stop sniffing <laughs> magic mastic. <laughs> All right, why don't we give this a try? Oh my God, it's so smooth looking. You know how like you take a jam or you take some uh, and it's like, it's chunky, whatever. This is very smooth. Oh my God, this is off the, the charts. So like, this is so good. Just like very ripe fruit flavors of the nectar. Oh my God. The mastica is just, it's there, but it's not in your face. And it's very complimentary. It's like the nectar and the mastica were made to be together. I need to, I need to hug the person that came up with this. This is absolutely amazing it's can, it's i'm telling you that the nectarine is is the dominant and the mastica is the the 
submissive, but they complement each other so well. It goes perfect. Wow. I mean, I can see this a great spread on your on your toast, on your oh my sandwich. God. Um, this is insane. This is so good. You can probably incorporate this in salads and different recipes, but even on your a dollop of this on your charcuterie board with some nice sharp cheese and some nuts. And Let me wine. just say this, Fati. You buy some of the products we have on Greekazon, you're going to make the most kick-ass charcuterie board ever. There's an idea. That's, you know, we should package that all together and sell it. Wow. This is super good. There you have it. All right. This is two, two nectarines way up in the air right here. This is, this is awesome. People, 100% absolutely must try, please. Must have. Must have, must try. This should be in every pantry in every household. You need this. Yeah. I, I mean, I, right now, all I'm thinking about is waking up tomorrow morning and like, toasting some bread and spreading this on. Now, imagine having your bread. You can pour the, you can spread this on your tsureki slices. Yeah, you could, yeah, I mean this. While, like... let me just point this out. While you're having a freshly brewed cup of mastica coffee, oh, which we'll oh. talk about in our next segment, in another segment. Ah, uh, you're blowing minds now, Fati. You are blowing minds. But seriously, like we, we talked about a couple of things and we keep throwing out the term uh, charcuterie board and all these things put together would make one kick ass charcuterie board. Done. So be on the lookout for the Greek Azon charcuterie board. <laughs> we got to do it. Absolutely. That would be so cool. All right. Now it. I'm excited. All right. Thanks everybody for watching. Get your uh, magic mastic. This stuff is insane thanks for the thank thanks you. for watching bye bye